Sawadiha. We just took a moto taxi from our hostel to the Jod Fairs Market, which is the biggest market, biggest night market in Bangkok. And it already looks pretty fancy so far. Look at these buildings. Oh Downtown Bangkok. We were the last couple days. Twin Towers. Over here. So yeah, we're just nice. gonna hit the night market, get some good food, and we'll see what we get. We got some food, some drinks. I'm sure, a it's good. Drinks, and then maybe hit the bars later. I, I guess we'll see. Uh, this definitely looks a bit more upscale than the other markets we've been at. Couple fishes, pretty dried up. Is that you, bro? I thought of jackfruit, maybe. I was gonna dare you. This one. Can I do that one instead? I'll leave that one. I'll leave this one. No, I'll leave this one. I'm not eating that, dude. Bro, this is our peanut. Mine is, mine is tiny, so I gotta eat a small one. Yours is huge. No, I'll dare you a different one. This is our peanut. Mine is, mine is tiny, so I gotta eat a small one. Alright, let's do it. Alright. One. Is that possible? Can I just do one? Just to try. No, no, big, no, big no, one, big one, big one. The smaller one. <laughs> yeah. How much? Ten baht. Ten baht? Ten baht? Shit. Get on it, bro. I was hoping that he wouldn't let me just get one. I don't even think I have ten baht. I'm not paying. Yeah, you gotta pay for me, bro. This is your... Yeah, I got ten baht. You're paying all that? It's like, can you show me, mama? Alright, 10 baht. 10 baht. Warm. What's it called? What is it? Whoa! Is it good? Uh, yeah. Texture? What's the texture? It's actually not terrible. <laughs> it's pretty salty. Oh, sorry, I just gotta stop looking at it. It wasn't that bad. Like, they cook it, it well. juicy, but. Oh, your eyes. <laughs> They cook it well then, eh? Bro, that was jank. <laughs> yeah, if I, if I close my eyes and somebody like, if it if it was like in the form of a chip, a potato chip with a little sauce on it, I would have probably been like, all right, maybe have a couple. But like, in maggot, in maggot form, it's, it's not uh, too inviting. Really? All right, you did it, bro. Good job. <laughs> This is like, if you're scared of eating like foreign food, come here and it's like, you can see that it's like a little more upscale so it's like probably better prepared and like more safely prepared. So like if you're too scared, come over here and have this instead of instead of some random side street yeah. chicken on a stick. You'll we'll pay a bit more but definitely looks yeah, like a it's good little safer. A good little introduction. Good introduction to Bangkok to and then maggots. go into the... We did the other way around, but it's all good. Yo! I'm jerking off too much. This kid, he's been jerking off. He's a lefty. Those look good. Muscles. Oh, look it. I think these are the muscles. Huge. It's like a foot long. So I'm gonna down this before it gets too hot. Might be buying a beer out here. I can't see the prices. Um, <laughs> Ask him. How much for a uh, singer? 
Asahi. Any bot? What about uh, Leo? Okay. I got that sign, dude. They want a uh, local, local IPA, bro. Local IPA, right there. You got Asahi? Oh, is this local? Oh, maybe this one. What about this IPA local? Where, where is it from? Yeah, how much? Oh, 160. Oh. Okay, I saw he good. <laughs> I don't know how I made double for the local beer, you know. Microbrewery. I just trimmed my beard, so I'm not I'm not that into the microbreweries right now. Oh, true. Come on, grab. I'm sorry, I only have a thousand. Yeah. Couple of nice beers out here. Obviously a bit more expensive than usual. 80 baht. 80 baht. It's nice and cold. It's nice and cold. I love All Asahi right. too. Alright, what's next? Straight ahead, baby. Oh, look at these. Yeah, yeah. I one of these. to walk around. A beef and a chick? Yeah. Hold it. Oh, that's good. Hello, hello. Huh? Yeah, I'm not bad. Oh, I'm going to be hot. How much? How much? One of each. One of each? Oh, 30. Beef, tw chicken 25. I don't know. 30. 35. Go. One chicken, one beef. They got racks of ribs too, eh? Yeah, these look juicy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, buddy. I had a bun. Look at all the steam. I don't know. Yeah, you can't really tell in the video, but this. Oh, look at those places are steaming. You can tell there's like a smoky area. Look there. at those. Look at those shrimp. We should see how much is a shrimp. We'll get you some lobsters and a shrimp. Oh, come on, crab. Crab. Oh, this would be good. Yeah, that's that's a decent price. They got they got blue twangs on it. I believe they're just all blue. But these are orange and blue. Little bubble bubblegum shrimp. Bubblegum shrimp. Alright, down here. Yeah. See Sean? Chicken? Chicken. Chicken on a stick? Chicken on a stick. Keep it healthy. It's delightful. Tremendous. Ah, it's alright. No, it's good to go. Oh. I just I dropped them. Mmm, it. it's good. Pretty saucy. Alright. That's good. Beef. Oh. That's it. <laughs> Whoa. Big bite, yeah. That's some Texas barbecue. Which one's better? I like the beef on a stick better. You can have the chicken, bro. Mm. Tender. Some good barbie. It's a bit tougher, but yeah. It's tender. It's a bit tougher. <laughs> it's tender, but tougher than the chicken. All right, we're gonna keep walking down here. It's so busy, but pretty cool. What's your name, bro? I, I got a joke. I got a joke. Sex in the city? 
Man, girl? I never watched that. That's my mom and sister. I just stepped in that. Oh, that's girls. Sarah Jessica Parker, bro. Oh. Come on, man. Yeah, that was gross. Say what I stepped in. Yeah, what was that? Alright. We're keeping on, keeping on. So there's even, yeah, like, just normal things here, some purses, backpacks, shoes, hats. Hey, look, you needed a hat, eh? Yeah, there's some nice hat. Yeah? Try a couple on, see if you like it. Maybe a thousand baht here. Boston. Boston. I'm from Boston. Oh, you're Canadian. You need the whole fit. We don't have the rest, bro. The tuxedo. Let's try this Asahi. Let's see it. It's way colder than the other. I know. Nice. <laughs> I saw one that I kind of liked, but it was it was wool. Yeah. That would have been bad business, bad combo what for. What do you mean? Thailand's pretty cold. Thirty-five. It's freezing. Thailand's pretty cold. Okay, so this market is famous for. Apart from all this exotic food. Beef tower. Beef tower, which is a 40 bucks US. Thousand. I'm ready to eat it all. Come on, bro. And all of those. I could eat one of these, bro. That'd be sick. Did they cook it up? Did they cook it up for you or not? Okay. Spicy with all that. Yeah, yeah, I think that's green chilies. Maybe a bit spicy. I don't know. Forty bucks a little out of my price range. Yeah, we'll see. You can watch uh, Mark Weens for uh, for that <laughs> tutorial there. Yeah, true. All right, we'll keep on keeping on. This guy's looking up these bras or something. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta keep an eye on this guy. Or he goes roaming wild. All right, so Luke might buy one of these hats. Just thinking about it. What are you looking? The Mickey's? The Mickey hats look sick. No brims. Oh, we gotta get this for Mike. She's happy. Maria. That'd be nice. I like this one. Try it on. That's Ready? It. Whoa! Uh, Is it good or no? I thought, it was like gonna, it? I thought it was gonna be way too small. Yeah. He's gonna buy a white hat, eh? Beige, sorry. Yeah, I don't know if it's a good idea. That green one. Or the darker beige, maybe even. You know. But New York, New York. But uh, I mean, white could be good. We'll see how the progression of dirtiness gets. You know. Bro, just buy this one. You're awesome. That one's awesome. All right, we've decided on a spot. We're gonna eat some of this. Pricier, but we're in this expensive market, so we're gonna get some braised pork, some noodles or rice. Uh, not bad, looks pretty good. People are enjoying it out here, so people are enjoying it. People are enjoying it. We're balling out today, boys. It looks like there's none empty though, so go, go talk to the lady Luke and see if she'll let us in. She's coming, bro. Do we stay here? Trust me, she's uh, coming. You make them come, eh? Fast. You make him come fast. Holy shit. Somebody have. Somebody have. Two. I'll go first. Oh. Two. Two. Yeah. Okay. Just no man. Yeah, okay. no problem. Yeah. Are they now? Yeah, it's order now. Uh. Two of these. Is this for one person? Two. 
Two person? Uh, this one and noodles. Soup. Okay. Uh, so let's get one person beef or pork? Okay, this for two. This for two people? Yes. Okay. We have rice. Yeah. I, mean, I like pork too. Uh, yeah, we can do pork and then we can do yeah. rice and. Maybe a starter. A boiled cream balls? Cool pork? Oh, this is pork. Oh, yeah. So maybe a I think we do one noodle, one rice, and, uh, and one morning glory. Uh, yeah, rice one, rice one, one. Good? Uh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. All right, we'll just wait here. I'm thinking about another Leo, but I'm getting a little. Yeah, we'll ask I'm already getting. Here. Little, I'm already getting a little foggy here. This guy had two beers and he's drunk. Uh, Can't take him anywhere. Uh, yeah, well. No, I had three, and two of them were tall boys, and one of them was that big. Uh, so I've had a six pack. I haven't seen any of that footage. I've had a six pack. I don't know. Alright, so we got a nice little spot here with the palm trees. Alright, pimps. So, as if we weren't gonna sweat enough variety. Uh, I'm pretty cold out here. We got some boiling hot, some boiling hot spicy pork ready to rock. That. Some uh, mornings, what is it? Morning greens. Morning greens. Rice, egg noodles. I think we'll mix it all up. I almost burnt the camera. <laughs> yeah. right. I don't really know how to attack this. How do we attack this? Yeah, we might need some extra plates, maybe, or but I don't know. I think you just put it in here. Yeah. Perfect. And of course, a couple of Leos. What else is new? Alright. Okay, so this is this is pretty hot. It's pork. It, it just came off the flame. Cheers. You can see that steam, right? Yeah, I see it. He doesn't care. All in one. Really good. It's good. I'll be on time about it. So tender. Tender. Super tender. Do you even bite it? You just kind of get a bit of that. I bite it. Motion, and then it just went in. It's good broth. Though. It's 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 good broth. I don't know jack shit about it. <laughs> I just know it tastes pretty good. All right. Another bite. Take it easy, man. Alright, so our friend here is going to have some spring greens. What is it, like spinach and beans, no? Cheers. I thought they'd be warm again. Maybe i dip them in here. Dip them in. Oh, that's way better. Dip them in there, bro. You'll see. Watch, watch, watch. <laughs> It gives it so much more taste. Oh, you cook it too. This guy's going crazy. All right. So Luke tried the noodles. So naturally, I have to go for the rice. A couple little scoops. Uh, some of this. Did you get one of the porks or no? Of course. A lot of greens. Yeah, this guy takes a whole salad with him. No worries. A bunch of broth. What happened? Oh, making a mess already. Alright. See how this goes. Break it up. Right there. Good rice. I never know how to eat rice with the chopsticks, 
I guess you just have to like scoop it in your mouth, yeah. but just scoop it. Yeah, that's yeah, good. That's pork, good. Though, eh? It's good pork. It's really super tender. It just goes right in. Alright, we're gonna stay here and sweat for a bit. <laughs> what is this guy doing? Alright, so went to John Ferris. It was pretty good. I mean, no complaints. Got it. If you're in Bangkok, I suggest going to John Ferris at least once. Definitely worth it. It's a good spot. Like, a bunch of different stuff, fresh stuff, whatever. It's like in the middle of. You can only see a couple of them, but there's uh, high rise. Double twine. Double, tw double, double twine. twine. A twin building. It's starting to rain. Black. Yeah. There's high rises it's all around. It's on like the other a preppy side. area. Yeah. Anyways, yeah, what do we get? <clears throat> we got some nice. So, yeah, we had a little hot pot and uh, chicken on a stick, beef on a stick. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. I mean. We didn't have the little beef tower that there's like there's like 20 restaurants in there that have that beef tower. But the one famous one and had like, the, like the a like huge giant line. one is like 40 bucks, but like single portion you probably pay like 10 or 20. Yeah, 15, something like that. Yeah. Um, so maybe hop on a couple moto taxis now and head to a bar or something. We're feeling a little twisty. I'm not gonna lie. We were already drunk. So this guy had uh, two, maybe three beers. Already wasted. Hundred, bro. 100 beers wasted and the dart is not gonna help him he's gonna be it is gonna help me back of the motor taxi like this going crazy so we'll see how it goes Hope nothing to see here on to the next cut, right. cut the cameras cut the cameras so <laughs> so um alright boys what just happened so we're in this hotel very nice you know we were at this bar we're not, we're not, we're not paying at this hotel, of course not. We can't afford that. We just went in to talk to some girls, and not, not talk to some girls. Talk to the receptionist. <laughs> talk to some girls. <laughs> we're talking to some girls, man. They are some girls, though. Anyways, they told us they're not selling any alcohol anymore, so we asked to go to the bathroom, and went to the bathroom. Luke took the only male bathroom. We're not taking pisses out here, so. We, we I just had to, blew him up. I had to go into the woman's. Anyways, I just discovered one thing that I think is going to change the rest of our, this trip for me at least. For you, what a bidet! If you take, yeah, if you take my advice. So you know, in in Thailand, you can't throw toilet paper in the in the toilet, right? You have to wipe and then throw it in the garbage they have nah, in each bathroom, right? But there's never that much toilet paper in the bathroom, so what do Thai people do? I don't know if this is what they do, but this is what I'm assuming. There's a little like shower hose, and some sh some toilets just have the shower as if it was a shower. But I think in these toilet trees, where it's just a toilet, they, they still have the hose. So I think, because at least for me, when I got here, every shat I've taken is liquid. So they just... Grab the shower hose, Paul. Wipe it down, Paul. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure bidets are worldwide. They are, but this is not a, it's not a bidet. It's just like a water hose, you know. That's what a bidet is. No, a bidet is. You ha I have it in my house. It's a set thing. You open it up and you sit. No, a bidet is a hose. No, you haven't seen a bidet. You went to my house. They were right there. I didn't use it. No shit on it. You should have. Anyways, the bidet is an actual thing right beside the toilet. You can move from the toilet to the thing. That's like Japanese style, though. It, yeah. it cleans your it cleans your ja your whole well, in, Johnson. In Spain, most bathrooms have bidets, even though not not many people use them. But we should. Anyways, you should. Anyways, I just use. I saw the hose there, and I was like, you know what? I'm sick of wiping. So I just grabbed the hose. Quick, quick, quick hose down there. And then you just need a couple of papers to dry off and you're clean as hell. Thoughts? This guy's disgusting, man. Thoughts? I, I have a cleaner butthole than you right now. 